sit on the floor call, Indian style. Just sit on the floor Indian style. Do you know what Indian style is? Do you know how to sit Indian style? There you go. See, yeah. let me tell you. Yeah. That right there is a good move, and I'll tell He's you why. Because at oh. one point... <laughs> at one point, what you did... Here, this goes in there, too. Why don't you put it all in there? Why don't you put it back in the box? Okay, so this is it. This is GT. How many people right off the bat? Let's just get a quick poll. How many people hate GT's guts? Oh, yeah. Vince, you didn't vote there. Do you have an opinion on this? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> is it a piece of shit? Oh. Yeah. oh okay. Turn it off. Turn it off. Turn it I'm off. <laughs> 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 Here, put this in your. Why did you open it like that? It was already there. I'll, I'll, I'll wind it up. Okay, here. Yeah. Oh, Alright, so, GT. Now, is there anything you want to say to the people? Someone give this animal a mic. No, not the good one. Not the good one. All right, do you understand why I have a problem with you? Uh, because of the van, the situation in the, in the film. I, I, I'm not really an angry person. Now, a lot of people think I'm an angry person. I'm not, I just, I was just messing around. When I came it out has nothing van. to do with the van. Because you don't give a shit about anybody. You've knocked over people. We talked about this on the last show. Do you have any remorse? You've had about three, four days since the last time that we spoke about this. Do you have any remorse whatsoever? Well, I, would, I, I was, the picture was taken one before I went in. You know, you saw that picture of me going like this. And uh, I can't really... I, I can't, know when it was taken because I saw when it was taken. Yeah. Just fucking shut up and listen to what it was. That was after he came. And I was thinking of going in, not really. And then when the guy, somebody said, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. Who said that to you? Some, uh, some one of your camera guys. You said Tyler. Yeah. Tyler, would you come up, ladies and gentlemen? What a man, what a man. I wish and Vogue and uh, we're here to say, what a man, what a man. What a mighty good man. GT is a fucking liar. I did not tell him shit. And I believe him. Admit that you lied about Tyler saying yeah, something. Yeah, look at me in the face and tell me you fucking lied about that. I GT said that he was just minding his own business back here. Then I walked up to him and said, hey, why don't you boss around and fuck with everybody? You're the real liar, dude. Why should I lie to my fucking fans? I got some fans out there. Yeah. yeah. My yeah. Fans. I'm not gonna yeah. lie to my, I'm not gonna look into this fucking camera yeah. and lie to my fucking yeah. fans. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? GT. I'm not a GT. liar GT. like you. GT. You're the one who's the liar. GT. GT, yeah. GT. Yeah. shut up. <laughs> I'm gonna ask you a question, GT. Now here's the deal. Here is the deal. Remember what I said when I told you, the only way that you can stay in this show is by following directions. And what you did, I know this man. I've known this man for quite a while. And there is no way he lied. So I'll give you one second to change the truth. Because Tyler had nothing to do with that. It might have been somebody else. But don't fucking put the blame on him. Because if that's what you're saying, you're a motherfucking liar. And I will tell people to fucking, because I'm, I'm sick and tired of this. So you want me to admit to something I didn't do so I could just go to jail? For life? Jail? I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. Like, I'm going to be gone. I'm going to be gone forever. You want it's going to be like jail. No, all that will happen here is this. Is that you'll be asked to leave and never come back here again. Exactly. It's like going to jail for life. No, you're not going to jail, you fucking blithering fucking idiot. And what I'm trying to tell you right now is you better get your shit together because I'm dead serious about this. I am throwing you out of the show. I mean, you're a dreadful human being, but people love to fuck with you. So for that reason, you're worth staying around. But if I have to put up with any shit from you, I will throw you the fuck out. And right now, you've got a chance to win the fucking hearts of Americans and people from other countries. But if you lie, because I guarantee you, I know Tyler, there's no reason in the world he would lie. Because he has nothing to lose by saying that. 
and, and, tell it, and, and so what do you want me to say? You want, I want you to tell the truth? I want you to tell the truth? I am telling the truth. Uh, no, you're not. You're a fucking liar. Okay, and if that's what you want to do, that's fine. But you know what? I want everyone to vote. Go to the go to the Ding Dong Show fan page. Vote. If you, it's on Facebook, and if you want to throw him out, there's a few options right now. I know that one was uh, people wanted you, us to smash your van, and then you can come back. Uh, but I'm saying that right now, you better start telling the truth because these people aren't going to like you at all. He's a guy. He on Facebook. He wanted to, uh, me to go with him to Griffith Park and see a special spot when he was in high school. I don't know what his deal is with me. Are you going to try to rape him when he got there? <laughs> well, I was just telling him if you wanted to go hiking, that's all. Yeah, right. <laughs> so you, I, just got, I was going to introduce go. him to that wildcat, P-22. Oh, yeah. You've heard of P-22? Yeah, I was going to take you to P-22 because, like because he's P -22. going around. What are you talking to time? She's talking. Stop it, you Armenian. This is an Armenian <laughs> dinner table where everybody's talking rudely while they're putting their hands in hummus. Let her talk a little bit. I was just saying that I liked friends of P-22 on Facebook. I'm quite interested in the, the doings of P-22. They wanted to change How did you know about P-22? Okay. He's a, a mountain lion Vince. in the Hollywood Hills. That yeah, is. Have you seen it? I, yeah, pictures of him. No, no have you seen him in person? No, that, that would be cool, though. He looks really cool. All right. I hey, like GT. GT, that's quite exciting, this whole thing. But we got off our train track here a little bit. <laughs> GT, can you hear me? I'm right here. All I can right. hear you. All right. I'm going to tell you this, and I really mean this. I'm fighting to give you a chance. A lot of people are like Tennessee and Tuxedo over here. Tennessee, can you come here for just a second? I really like you to tell him exactly how you feel about him because you know what? I don't think he really understands because he tries to sell it as you guys are buddies. Uh, no, he does understand. Though. He's lying. He's a piece of shit. He's a miserable fuck. And he's just trying to make everyone else miserable by uh, making himself the center of attention by being a cunt and ruining everything. Yeah, he's lying. He knows That's funny. <laughs> What's that, funny about it? Just the way Tennessee uh, kind of just uh, lays it out. Do you like that, Tennessee? Yeah. Okay. So do you understand? This is the way people look at you. Tennessee, he was ta t teaching me about South Park and all those characters. And Okay, and because he talked to you one time, do you think he likes you? Uh, I don't know. I can't really tell. <laughs> yes and no, I don't know. <laughs> How many people think that he's just being... St how many people think he is really this dumb? And how many people... Wait a minute, let's give me the other side. Or the other side is how many people feel that he is just fucking with everybody? All right, who thinks he's really this dumb? <laughs> you, have the, you have the whole cast thinking that. Now, how many people think he's just being an asshole prick and doing this to start with? It's about 50-50 right there. And I'm telling you. I just, the reason I want to take him to Griffith Park is because... Uh, okay, we're not talking about that, you fucking moron. Shut up. <laughs> Shut up. And listen, dude. I'm telling you for one last time. Because you know what? These people are voting. And when they vote, I'm taking their fucking observations and I'm going to fucking throw you out of the show. And I'm telling you. I am working my ass off to make something out of this thing, and we're getting some fucking interest. How do you think almost 400 people show up here for a room of whole Yeah. I did approach him. I said, hey, can you come to my show? And he said, yeah, I'll come to your show. Oh, that's funny. Yeah. Oh, that's funny. Oh, you really are seen as an evil person. Because you're a dumb fucking moron. And you're trying to fuck with people. That's what I think. A lot of people think he's stupid. Tennessee, your feelings? I think he's imaginably trying to get a song going that he needs to sell. Okay, we're a little lost there. Don, what's Ruck up there? I'm going to ask Ruck because Ruck, no, Ruck, you got a mic? Watch the cake. Watch the cake. No, Ruck is what we just said. Now, a few weeks ago, Ruck was always on your side. Always on your side. Then, during one of your fucking mosh dances again, you fucking went and you, I saw you do it. You pushed his friends that came to see this show. You were a piece of shit there, 
and he has changed Who his Who did I push? Anybody here? Okay, I, I told you before, you fucking moron. You pushed two of his friends. It doesn't matter. Ruck at your feelings on him, honestly, the truth. Man, fuck this dude! Yeah. yeah. Okay, only if it's about this subject. Yeah, I was watching Hawaii Five O. <laughs> and I saw I saw this I saw this dude on, on Hawaii Five O and he was just like TT. Yesterday. <laughs> Anybody? <laughs> That would be one of the four or five they did in this whole town. But there was this, there was this dude and and, and uh, Steve McGarrett that they were. The dude was tripping. And we don't like him. Usually we watch it together, but I wasn't there did, yesterday. Did you, uh, you no, I was on the plane. Okay, you I was on the catch it. No, but okay. Yeah. Yeah, really. I don't even have a TV, man. I wait until there's a sale, a sale, uh, a, a, a zero percent sale on TVs next time a cop shoots some unarmed team. Yeah, I got a busy out of a 32 inch black screen. Okay, the last time there was a big riot type situation? I mean, I just call it a TV sale. Yeah. Justice, we call it. Okay, but I'm asking him, you got a big flat screen, 32 inch, right? My, uh, my mom and dad uh, gave it to me. That's not as gangster as you were trying to sell it as a minute ago. It was just a hand-me-down. That's pretty gangster. <laughs> okay, well, anyway, so do you get it at all, GT? GT, yeah, I'm right here. Yeah. I'm right here. Sit up. Is he lying down? Yeah. GT, look at me. I'm looking at you, bro. No, you're not. Look at me. Boy, nothing is there at all. <laughs> Just nothing is there. What's going on? <laughs> I try to, uh, you know, uh, listen. I try to get my friend. Listen to me. Listen Stand to me. On your Stand butt. Listen Stand to me. On your all your comedy ins what are you doing? Sit on your butt. Come I was on. like, people can't trust me. I try to look at Frank John Large some mentos, he won't take it. <laughs> you know, because uh, sure. Is there anybody here that has a question for this fucking idiot? Because he's not doing anything worth while. Anybody got a question about anything? Anybody? I got a question. Go ahead. Go ahead, Tennessee. GT, how many bands have you contacted to sell your song to? How many bands? That's what you need to do. Yeah. Maybe listen to Tennessee, you'd be in the same position I called, he is. I called up uh, the Night Train, I called up the Armenian mean? Comedian, and you called up me one day too, but you need to call up bands who have money. By the way, give a nice hand for Tyler telling the truth. The question over there, yes. GT, the truth will set you free. Truth will set you free, yeah. dude. Who's that, who's that? That's the Lord. All right, John Lawrence. He wouldn't take my Mentos. Go ahead, question. What's your name? Where are you from? What high school? Kenny Lyon, Hollywood High. You don't really need to. Are you really are from Hollywood High? Shut up! Ask the question, please. GT, on a scale from 1 to 10, how scared were you when Don was about to kill you? I wasn't about to kill him, first of all. Well, first of all, it was exciting. Aww. But it was like, I feel, I feel like being attacked by a bear. It was like, wow! I was like, yeah! This is like a adrenaline rush, man. Right there. But he's like pushing me and then boom, before you know it, I'm getting killed. <laughs> <laughs> I have a question. You are, you are the dumbest person I've ever known. I am begging people to vote to kick him out of the show because I cannot stand this fucking <laughs> Yes, go ahead. Uh, I would like GT to tell everybody how he's going to make the Ding Dong Show a better show. Uh, how am I going to make the Ding Dong Show a better show? What are you going to do if you were in the show to make it better? Because right now all you do is interrupt it. Um, I, I, don't really, I don't really have any plans. I don't really have plans. I'm trying to, a lot of, a lot of my fans, like Michael Rampage, he's always telling me. <laughs> he's not a fan, but he's sort of like. Hey, let me fun. let me explain. Stop, stop right there. Michael Rampage, who has a very good friend by the name of Janelle. Yeah, 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 yeah. Janelle, yeah. Janelle, right? Janelle with a big ass, right? <laughs> big, See, that's why big fat, raw, juicy ass. See, nobody likes that. Hit him in the head with uh, my stomach. I apologize. I apologize. I apologize. Oh my God. Nobody, nobody oh, hit him. God, you were just plain. Mary Jane, dig Stop! it. Stop! 
Look at me, you fucking morons. You stupid idiot. Don is the analyst. Who's hosting the show tonight? I don't know. Not me, I guess. All right, I am trying my very best to give you an opportunity because I think that what you do, your stupidity just is so loud. So what? <laughs> you literally have the attention span of a gnat. What is going on? All right, you, have, you, you can't keep lying. I, I, I've never met, I never met a gnat before. What is that? A gnat. It's a very small flying bug. Yeah, they're very small. Are you, are you, do you, do you think that I don't like this, to bugs for some reason? When you act this, shut up! Yeah. When you act this stupid, do you think it's going to help you? Let, let me explain something to you. You have, I'm like this, I'm shut like, up! Oh you have absolutely nothing going in your life. Nothing. There's a few radio shows that will bring you on to make an ass of you. We have a show here that's a weekly chance for you to make an asshole of yourself. All I ask of you is to fucking try to understand what's going on and to fucking listen to what I'm saying. But I guarantee you, Rucka doesn't like you. Tennessee, do you like him? Truthfully, be honest. Do you think he adds to the show or do you think he subtracts from it? I love him. No. <laughs> <laughs> I love to kill him. I love to kill him. If he doesn't yeah. sell one of these songs for an upscale. How <laughs> <laughs> did I know that it would become involved in you?